Tom and Ben is a young couple who want to have a house. Tom is a hairdresser, and Ben she is a teacher. Both of them cannot afford to have normal house. They came to our building workshop, and then they want to build their own house. So they have problem with making bricks in their area. So we decide to come to help them. We organize a joy force party to help him. Tom used to help many people in the past. Now is the time for us to help him. This is what we call joy force party. To make bricks is not very hard at all. We just till the soil, make the soil loose, and then we can make a dike. The dike to make the edge around the dirt that we till them to make it into a pit where we can fill up with water and then keep water in that pit. It's important to till the soil very loose before we add water in there because it will absorb water very fast. We add a lot of water in the pit to make the water cover the whole soil in the pit and then we just let it sit wet for the soil to absorb water as much as they can. When the water almost dry up, we just walk into the pit. If our feet sink to the bottom of the pit, that means it absorbs very well. We can mix it after that. But if our feet still stay on top, still feel something hard at the bottom, we cannot touch the bottom of the pit yet. Don't mix it yet. Just add more water and wet a little bit longer. And then for this pit, it's a lot of rock. That's why we can use hole to help to mix it because it's harder to mix with sharp rock. After we mix a little bit, when the soil is really loose, we just add rice husk or any kind of fiber that's not too big and not too long. The fiber, there's no recipe to add in there. We experiment. If the pit not very big, we add one bag of rice husk or a short straw and mix it very well and test by making a break from it. If it crack, that means it's not enough fiber. If it's not crack, that means it's good. When we mix it very well, it's ready to bring to make bricks. We just scoop, put in the bucket. This is the mold or the form to make a bricks. The size is 4 inches thick. The width is 8 inches. The length is 16 inches. You can make it any size that you like, but this size is good for us. Before we use the form, it's good to wet it first. It will not stick. The mud will not stick with the form. It will be easy to remove the form when we fill up with mud. And even the bucket that we are going to use, it's good to wet the bucket first because it helps stop uh, sticking on the bucket. So level the floor very well and put the form on the ground and pour the mud in the form and level it. If the mud to dry, we need to push it. If we have to push it, that means it's too dry. So it's good to add more water in the pit. If we take the form off and it lose the shape, that means it's too wet. It's good to add more fiber in there. So there's no recipe to mix the mud. Just try it. What is easy? Like this one is easy. When we take out the form, the bricks stay in the good shape. That is good. Just keep doing like this. If we have a few people work together, it's okay to use a single mold like this. But if we have more than 10, 
our mole can be double or triple any size is okay so we don't need to make a lot of mole just only one like this is good enough for a few people the kid is very good labor to do this part because they have a lot of fun all kids love to play with mud today six of us can make only 500 bricks all day but the next day we will make more because the first day is always slow after the bricks ready we let it dry for one or two day and we can turn the side up like this it will dry a lot faster this side of the brick 4 by 8 by 16 we use about 16, 25 bricks per square meters we can calculate easily and then when we finish making the bricks we just let it dry in the sun for six or seven days and we can use to build anything after that we can make anything with this brick like normal concrete bricks joint force party is very fun and it helped us to do the big job very fun and fast because if we don't have money but we have friends we have many people who really want to help we just invite them to help each other by this way we can do many things even we have no money we come to help Tom and Ben only one day but it helped them to have enough brick to build their house 